Hey guys, this is your boy Homer Ziggy. I'm back in here with another video. And today, we're here with Crip Bury the Life official music video. Now, this is from his album Bury Alive. And it's like this. The thing is, when I was doing the live reaction, right? And also, shout out to all who's watching it and such. The thing is, I was almost done to it until when something happened something like was wrong with the spotify thing or so so even though i heard almost all the songs it's just this song i wasn't able to hear because i don't know why because it's saying it couldn't play for me but regardless the album itself was fire i just i'm just trying to address this name here but regardless the album itself was fire shout out to crip for commenting on my video he a real one for show and it's like this literally when i looked at it it's like this man for the thumbnail and such i saw the man literally burying a you know literally burying alive literally have dirt on him so what the hell yeah even on his instagram he was saying that like one like equals the amount of one like equals one pint of dirt or one dirt he ate also so regardless i want to see how this video is and with the song the self song the song buried the life from the title buried life could that either well it depends so i was gonna say it's either have like a bomb beat or so a you can say like a typical lyrical rapper type of beat beat but or it's a slow emotional song type of beat but regardless with the way how it is when it comes to crip one way or another we know it's gonna be fire so believe me I've never of all the times I've reacted to crip songs and such me personally and this is not no I'm not being like a stan or anything maybe a little but not a lot I'm just saying, from all the times I'm listening to his songs, I've never once not heard, I've never not once heard one bad song. No, I never heard a bad song, that's what I'm trying to say. But regardless, we'll see how this is, because this is 3 minutes and 55 seconds, basically almost 4 minutes, so I ain't trying to waste no time. You better check this music video out, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and Without further ado, let's get in the video. Somebody save me from myself. I'm following my demons all the way to hell. Talking to In the eyes of the public while they wait to watch you fail Every day they're looking for something old To bring up something new if they see you doing well Facts They always want to bring up something that's from the past and such Just to bring you down because you see They see you doing well And literally That's what for almost what But for a little while now That's literally what They've been doing to Eminem but we see how that goes. Nobody gonna do that. So let's face it. We he, we all know Eminem is never gonna get canceled for anything. Cause if you couldn't cancel him before, from all the stuff he did prior to before, like cancel culture or whatnot, and so if you couldn't cancel him before, then what makes you going? What makes you think you gonna cancel him now? And that's how people are they would literally drag up things that are in the past and such that you did before and such 
just to bring you down because they see you doing much better than they are. Do you know what it's like to live your life in the eyes of the public while they wait to watch you fail? Every day they're looking for something old to bring up something new if they see you doing well. And God Thanks. forbid you did some things in the past, man, you might as well just hang it up to dry. Cause in this day and age, change don't mean a thing, they'll cancel anything in sight. The Ooh, they'll cancel it. Change. To be honest, that is literally how today's world is right now. Literally, you can't even say nothing as a little joke or so. Cause, or trying to change anything. Because at the end of the day, literally where we are right now, they will cancel anything right now. They'll cancel you for saying something that's homophobic. Even if you're doing it as a little joke. But regardless, I know that some of the times it's wrong or so. But it's like this. If it's a minor joke, it shouldn't be even try to get canceled. Like literally, like I heard, they literally try to cancel. They cancel and put Mr. Potato Head, so you can't even say Mr. or so. You gotta say Potato Head. Like what? These people are casting stones for things they've done themselves. They just don't have a million people praying they fail and watching every move they make and honing on their mistakes and shows the world that you're not who they think. The pressure keeps mounting higher. I no longer desire to live this life I chose because I'm no longer inspired. But these people require me to keep bringing a cipher. So I'll speak till I'm tired, holding my feet to the fire, screaming. Somebody save me from myself. I'm following my demons. He's one. I'm guess whoever's there with him doing that, cause there has to be somebody else doing it. I'm betting he's. I'm betting there's like bloopers or so. To every time that he's have dirt in his mouth, he gotta go. <laughs> Some kind of my teeth, <laughs> like. It's like a read your mind, dude. Fine, then why would you even try to keep and hide secrets deep inside? You're speaking lies and redefined who I knew. What can I do? Stuck in my room, demons swirl around like typhoons. Like mm. demons swirl around like typhoons. Mm. And hey, sometimes they that is true. Just when you think that you're in the clear or so about things, if you're trying to go to a higher purpose and such. You're always going to find something that haunts your past come back to haunt you again. Like basically something from your past or so haunting you. Deep and hide secrets deep inside. You're speaking lies and redefined who I knew. What can I do? Stuck in my room. Demons swirl around like typhoons. Life is like a tightrope that I'm walking in. I want to take that rope and tie a noose. Preparing to mm. die. Scary inside. Bottomless lows. Heroin high. Staring in the eyes of death, I'm paralyzed I guess it's time for them to bury me alive Maybe now you see the bar you set for me Is higher than the one that I can actually reach This is what you wanted, raise yourself those high Lay me in the dirty, bury me alive Somebody save me from myself I'm following my demons all the way With all jokes aside, the vid, this is, there's still more left, but all I gotta say is this. It's a crazy thing that people are that, people are that vindictive or so to find stuff that, that's in somebody else's past or so. Just to come, just to bring it up and try to bring them down. Just because the person who did all those stuff before are trying to move away from it so that they that way they can like go higher be more successful try to do some good in their life but always gonna find the haters who are always trying to bring them down and to those people look here you see this but you 
Y'all know what I'm talking about. To all those haters out there who does something like that, I ain't trying to make YouTube see and all, but y'all know what this is. Y'all, y'all know who, y'all know what this is. But regardless, they need to, they need to get a life demo of their damn so in my demons all the way to Y'all both go get that man's album. Hey man. Shout out to Quip man cause the fact like he said, rest in peace to DMX and hey man. The man is on a roll. Y'all can't tell me. But trust me, you gonna have something more. And it's like this. Shout out to Crip again. Keep on doing what you're doing, man, and hope to see, hope to hear more music and so, and more music videos from their album for this. But regardless, let me know what you think down in the comments below. It's been your boy Humble Ziggy signing out. Stay positive and keep the vibes up. Let go.